With race weekend comes lots of excitement and plenty of things to do. Here with a few ideas is Terry Reefstick with Experience Champagne Urbana. Terry, welcome. Thank you. Okay, this is a great weekend to be in Central Illinois. It is. It's one of the biggest weekends of the year, and we're so excited to welcome thousands of people into this community. Yes. Okay, so let's kind of go through the rundown of the weekend yes. of things that people can do, whether it be race related or not. Yeah. Um, but everyone's gathering their stuff there at the Ark, getting yes. their, their bibs and what have you. Yeah, so it's a great event to go and check out, even if you're not running the event, because there's all sorts of opportunities to learn about, um, you know, different races happening across the country, uh, pick up gear, and of course, we will be there giving out our wooden nickels, which are very popular. For those that don't know, um, these are good for discounts around town. We have two dozen businesses signed up that are doing discounts all over, including places to eat, places to shop, some experiences. The one that always goes over really well is the free carousel ride at the mall. Oh, and do you, you don't have to participate you in the not. race to get a nickel. Correct. Okay, yep. very good. So go swing by, pick those yep. up. And then um, there's also, everyone looks forward to the race being over when they yes. cross the finish line <laughs> and everyone can celebrate. That's right. We host the 27th Mile uh, Celebration sponsored by Meyer there on uh, Kirby Avenue right when you come out of the stadium. And it is my favorite thing to welcome runners as they come down and offer them their free beer from Rick's Beer Company. <laughs> um, it's always a great time. We have live music. Uh, this year we're going to have top 40 that are promising to entertain us and keep us dancing and celebrating. We're also going to have about nine food trucks. There's going to be a youth fun zone. There's a stretching zone. So lots of opportunities to stop even if the weather is a little rainy and sprinkly, it's going to be a great time. Yes, okay. And then once the race is over, there is still plenty to experience here yes. in Champaign-Urbana. Yep. If there's any Pink Floyd fans out there, yes. there's this, something fun happening. Yeah, this is super exciting. This, this is the first time that State Farm Center is hosting something after the marathon. Um, so it'll be interesting to see that turnover, but they're going to be doing um, Pink Floyd Nation there um, Saturday night, and it's an immersive Pink Floyd experience. It's going to be crazy good with awesome lights, great music. Um, there is a cool discount that we put on our Facebook page if you do still want to get tickets for that. Um, it is happening Saturday night uh, there at the same farm center. Okay, it sounds like just about every hotel room is booked in the area. Yes. Let's talk about the economic impact that yeah. this event has on Champaign-Urbana and Savoy. Yeah, it's really exciting because, you know, when you think about events like this, it takes a lot for it to, to go off smoothly, right? You're involving public works, you're involving the different cities, you're involving extra porta potties, right? All these extra <laughs> services that are needed, which means jobs are are being supported, uh, temporary workers are being hired, um, and then our restaurants are going to be full, our hotels are going to be full, our shops are going to be full, and that brings in a lot of dollars to this community. Um, it means people get more tips, right, when they're serving people at the restaurants. And so, you know, it may be a little bit inconvenient for a little bit to get around town, um, but trust me, it is worth it when the investment comes back into our community. It's it's about a $5 million economic yeah, impact. That's crazy. Our, I know you're a runner. Are you participating? <laughs> I'm running the 5K, but then okay. I'm going to be getting people beer on Saturday. You're so. volunteering, which we also need quite a few yes, of to make this event definitely. successful. Definitely, and thanks to all the volunteers. And we love it, too, when people are out there cheering for runners. So if you're not participating, yeah. get out there and cheer them on. Yes, find you a clever sign to yes. make, because um, those were always my favorite part Absolutely. about volunteering, reading the signs. All right, so much happening. People yep. can go to your Facebook for the code, go to Correct. your website for more information. Yep, absolutely. Okay, if you want to learn all about what's happening out and about in Champaign-Urbana and Savoy this weekend, we'll connect you with Experience Champaign-Urbana at our website after today's show.